Bomb sites, a little bit of utility towards the upper bombs, but it's quickly towards Lonks, and there's the shot, there's the drop, there's it a safety, and Slax is ready and waiting in the back. They've got a lot of players here, actually. A decent rotation for Sprout, but it just doesn't work. Wow, some stunning shots with the Glock coming through. That really did break up that three-way crossfire they had going on. A little bit unfortunate, because you're right. The rotation was pretty good. They had enough people in the ramp to probably surprise somebody with... <laughs> Why not? You hit them running, you're feeling good at the start of it. We're going to find Lorx at the start, and now it's just stair left. One versus four, and I mean, you can get some more money. We've seen this before. You get enough money in this round. Actually, you can get some great headshots here. You could buy something in the next one if you're feeling super aggressive about it. Scout for outside, maybe, or an M4 if you, you know, you could drop it over. <laughs> a lot think, of ways to go with it. I think Spirit kind of came to that same realization as well. They're like, that's a bit too much. Yeah. Too, that's not cool. Big door. And they want to go for it again. Wow, he's actually just running <laughs> alive. He might have just been waiting, hoping that there was going to be a little bit more aggression from the spirit side of things. Yeah. And then he could have jumped on it with, you know, 30 health left. And instead, he just burned all the way down. Long's going to be taken down. Wonderful. But still, this is around that. Once again, spirit are handling very well. The sirens low on health, and that's a bit awkward. Now, suddenly a two on two with a shot from the scout up at heaven to take down Patsy. That changed so quickly. This, had, this is a round one for Spirit, and now instead, it's going to be up to Magic to try and see if he can do some kind of trickery here. Oh, this is awkward. Smoke is up. He's really waiting for it. He has to go for it now, because otherwise he has to keep doing it. He can fake it maybe one more time. Slax out on that scaffolding. <laughs> he will finally go down. Oh, crazy round. <laughs> Devastating. Oh, what a nice catch from Siphon. That's going to really slow them down. They can't, they just have to wait 10 seconds on the clock and they're still in the lobby. They get a double opening. Eight it's seconds, it's they over. have to keep going. They can't slow this down. Wonderful gets one more. And Longs now, time has run out. They wanted to get that bomb zone, but they just could not do it. They get another kill. They get three, four kills in the round. Molotov, that extra Molotov right at the end with what, like 18 seconds? This hit is beginning with like 10, 11 seconds on the clock. Like, that's always going to be impossible. There's always going to be no way you win this one. And uh, the, the real shame of it is some very nice kills coming out from Spirit, just no time. It's actually well established in Europe, in Eastern Europe, to, to be able to get the job done and find your way into a pro team. Yeah, surely has got to be really healthy for the scene as a whole. Good times. Siphon, not really feeling that pressure back here. Uh oh. Going to be hanging out. Although feeling pressure now. Yeah, that's a bit uncomfortable. Got some teammates showing up to try and help him out. <laughs> All right. Nearly caught. That's actually probably a really good move. Why give them the opportunity? Two on three. Again, clocks run down very low. One of the CTs is down below and almost works out. But Magnus gets him, comes up with a double. That's crazy. And he gets time just barely to put the bomb down. Grenade around the corner. He's not going to kill him, but it will absolutely slow him down. And the Molotov means he can't really move. Yeah, he can't go to the other side. He's just stuck here. Siphon all the health in the world, and he doesn't want to take that fight straight up. He's hoping to get the instant headshot, but it's not going to be possible. A one versus hey guys, make sure to check out Cisco Fast, the oldest website in the industry. Cisco Fast has many cool price raffles, daily bonuses, and gifts for regular users. Their website has the biggest variety of different modes, including PvP modes, such as Classic, where you try to play versus other players, or PvE modes, such as X50, Poggy, Crash, and many other, including my favorite game, Tawa, where you try to climb to the top and the higher you get, the higher is the reward. Here, as an example, with just $5, I managed to get all the way up and got $212 as the reward. So guys, if you want to play on CSGO fast, don't forget to use my code VLADO to get $1 for free on your balance. Link to CSGO fast will be in the description below time for spirit to do anything you it was an some credit for spirit. yeah oh right. my god Ooh. my brain is working Ooh, spicy taking his time with it he's oh. got the bomb turning his back as well it's got to be scary well his hand is forced gonna get that kill pick up the awp and run straight for it that's very aggressive he's got some backup here now but sirens taking care of that one jump almost got him killed but more people keep showing up in the lobby. Yeah, that's a god tier round from, from Siren. Uh, he takes the initial fight, doesn't kit the kill, doesn't win the engagement, but backs away. He expects the follow-up fight from Hut, 
That was so perfectly played. I'm very impressed. He even takes the angle to grab the repeat from Rufus. See if he get a little bit more. Might see the shadow if they jump up on the box here, or you definitely will see the shadow, so that's always a little bit of an advantage, but it looks like they're hard. Oh my god! Stair coming up with some beautiful shots, and now Siphon's shown up with the M4. They're gonna swing against him, and Chopper trying to rescue and recover the round for his team. Two versus three. Blancs and Slacks are both positioned in lobby and hut, so they're actually away from any kind of a danger that would wrap around the mini. Good spot from Refresh. He can survive in this position, but not for long, or can he? What a great kill. This round's done. Magisk might even be able to get the plant. He can sense it's coming, finds one kill, still two more, and they're converging. Yeah, coming in is... Oh, I can't believe it. it looks like he had seen that. The fact that he even got the bomb plant in that one versus three is still pretty good, but... Um down on the ramp. One good flash around the corner and he might be in trouble, although he lands a bit behind him. But still, the FAMAS, not really with the stopping power that you would want there. And also Panzer getting a kill on the other side, so clean round. That would be a nice start. Also feels like Spirit came in with a game plan, which I guess is not that surprising if you've seen, the, seen their other games to play a little bit slow, but it feels like now they... They also look comfortable changing that and going a little bit quicker at it and hammering a little bit more time, so... But though, if they don't actually know that it's occurred, flashbang, yeah. way back. Oh, it goes too deep, lands behind the wall. And that costs Siren his life. Three versus four now. If the defense stays like this, there's surely no way that Spirit can actually get into the round and Magic's trying to see if he could follow up, but... I don't know how you get out of this one. No, Chopper knows that's a losing battle as well. Save the AKs at this point, surely. Yeah, I think so. I think that might have to be the call. Good shot from Wonderful. That's the player inside the bomb site. Still got a lot more to do, though. Flashbang is out. They're going to go for it. Chopper's challenging. Should be able to get a plant, actually. Yeah, indeed he will. So a three-on-two retake, and they're in pretty strong positions. No nades either really on the uh, Sprout side. You want to be careful. Low on health, and all they need is a bullet for him to go away. Slacks gets downed and Wonderful gonna go hide, try and hide in the corner, but Stair will find him. Nice triple for him. It's Siren who's waiting for pushes. Big fight to win. Oh, the timing. Timing's horrible. It's horrendous, which gives Refresh the angle. It felt like he was checking behind him way more than he needed probably to needed to, yeah. Maybe a little bit of nerves. Yeah, it happens. Oh. That is a shot outside, blowing up Stair, and they're going to go right behind. They want to go out again, trying to check all the angles. Looks like he might have got stuck a little bit there, and Chopper is going to get blown up as well. Nice defense. Just try and, and feel, offset a little bit of defense. I feel like Spirit's changed their mind about three or four times in this round. Yeah, they have, and we're kind of back to the start of the half as well, where they're running out of time. Long's going to get one. Siphon cruises into the bomb site. It's going to be good, picking up a double kill. Still 10 seconds on the clock, and holding it right now while the bomb is being planted. This is a winnable round, and finally this very late round execute coming in from Spirit seems to have worked out. They get the bomb plant, they're in a 2v2, and they picked up some rifles on top of everything else. Slags walking up, scoped up and down below. If he walks into the cross as a patsy, there's nothing he can do about it. That's an easy kill onto Refresh. And Slags, he's no idea where to aim. Good little quad kill coming out at the end. Spirit switched over to the CT side. Patsy's gonna challenge. Oh, okay. <laughs> that was a drive -by. <laughs> I don't even, I don't even see the gunfire. Oh my lord, Magic's with another one. And Sprout is just losing players every step of the way. Yeah, and you can't even really continue to run. You've just you've just sacrificed the player. You don't get anything for it. Not a lot of information. Not really a lot of map control. Sirens out on top, raining down. Death. Oh my God, that is amazing. Not a single casualty on the side of Spirit. Expected already. Ended the NIP honeymoon. <laughs> True indeed. Oh well. MP9 on top, and it is a slaughter down below on the B bomb side or oh, the A bomb side. Sorry. Utility towards mini. Some challenges, some spam as Refresh drops. It's quick, it's very fast, and he catches Patsy off guard. Didn't see it coming. It was so quick, and now the SMG has to drop into safety. Has to drop into safety, and Stair's got that. Wonderful, and the site has two. It's a good reload. It's got to come in quick. Another mag enters the gun, and Wonderful's got a third kill, and now the defense has arrived. The door slams shut. But that's a FAMAS up there against the AK and Simon. You trust that spray? At range. Oh, wow. That was a battle that never stopped. You get run down by a Mac 10 and just get a bullet to the face. Nobody likes that. 
Dropping down the vent. No one's there by the stop them either. Finally down below. Chopper is going to be there. And the Molotov is actually amazing. Might have been just one kill, but look at the damage on the slacks. And onto Larynx as well. They're right down below and they don't even know about it. Yeah, they just coming down. That's, that's devastating. That was the slowest drop off the railing ever, though. I thought that was actually going to be horribly wrong. It's all on stair. 1v3. The bomb did get planted. And as you, as you pointed out, it was so slow that they actually at least got that. See what he could do. They do not have a kit in place, so they're going to have to try, tap that bomb pretty quickly. He has to reveal his position then. And wow, Siren coming in, just dropping in the vent. But they were a little bit far away in lobby, so they can't even really use the information that they get, Sprout. And Siren's back up here. There is a Molotov. They could try and Molotov out the hut. Instead, they're just going to get the kill cleanly. And now it's a bit interesting. They smoke off Mini, and they want to put the pressure on Magic's still in the back of the bomb site. And he nearly gets the double. His teammates following up, Chopper up at the heavens. And he'll be able to get a triple in the round. 13 to 8, and go for the afterplant instead. Refresh, make it a run through. Fire and smoke, and onto the A bomb site. He wants to find the opening. They know about Chopper. I can't believe it took so long, but they do find him in the back of the site. Siren's going to be overrun as well. Three on three. Ooh. And they find the headshot. I can't believe that even happens. Patsy's out here looking to battle the whole team on his own, and that's too much. One single point of health left on Refresh, but what an opening he gave to his team. Wonderful, though. That shot nearly connects. He's low on health. Okay. Grenade to chase him down. And Sprout finally winning around again. If he gets that kill and it's one HP. Stair making the run outside. Wonderful is right in front. The flash to push him back. They know they have him. Patsy, though, there to revenge it. If they would have had him on the first volley of bullets, that would have been excellent. They probably could have just escaped. Four on four. And they're going to be going towards the ramp room instead. Magic's here. Yeah, don't be screwing off the silencer. He's ready. Instead of running back, just catching refresh. And he's still sticking around, battling all the way to the death. Long's not ready for Chopper to be down here. And low on health stacks coming around the corner of the FAMAS. That is a nicely handled triple for him. And once again, Sprout cannot completely take away the economy of spirit. So well done from Chopper. And try and see if they can put a little bit of pressure on. Oh, they're making so much noise running past here, and he's ready for it just as the smoke fades. No way. What an absolutely disgusting hold outside. Patsy on the triple, nearly a quad kill. That should be the round. I love Patsy. What a great round that is. What a great triple kill he gets there. Might have just delivered Team Spirit this first round in the series. That's what it feels like. A scout on Slacks as well, and he's got the most HP. That's never going to make you happy, and uh, there's no way for him with that weapon to clear out this kill, that position. Chopper's got another one in a stellar performance, leading the way for his team. 24 kills. He'll end at the top of the scoreboard. And Zyphon is the last one to go down. It's Spirit. 16 to 9. A statement win on their own map pick. A strong... Still the danger of a late flank coming in, but they found a good opening right here, and this is dangerous. Slax and Siphon, they might be in a little bit of trouble. Smoke comes over and they can't hit any of the shots on the CT side. That was a long, long battle that was happening between the USPs and the Glock there. And ultimately, it's going to be in favor of Spirit. All the aggression and all the flanks, I think Sprout just was never in a position where the defense is just going to be weakened by virtue of, of resources, of manpower. Refresh with a nice uh, low impact kill in garbage time. Put some uh, numbers on the board. Aggressive on the ramp, they're actually walking in. They could maybe surprise the T side. Wonderful's gonna take a peek and he'll get one of the kills, but look at the overwhelming amount of people coming in from the Sprout side. They're just running them down at the moment. Patsy gets overrun and now it's down to just Magic's one versus one against Stair. And three HP and seven HP. Stair's been on this three health since the very start of the round. All oh, this is perfect from Stair. Yeah, really, really good call, and all of one bullet is all he needed. Not, uh, not bending or breaking quite yet. They want to be back with Tech Dines. They're in the middle. This is dangerous. You're up, way over peaking it. That's exactly what happens. Just wasn't on his mind, although this is a nice knockout. Double kill for Siphon. That's going to make it a little bit different. Oh, yeah, but Chopper, especially if this kill comes out from Patsy, that's going to pull them forward into this rotation. They realize Chopper, he's already gotten a kill. They might expect it. What a shot. What a transfer over. And it's just Slacks left to recover 1v2. And Chopper's going to hold him at bay for as long as possible. Yeah, and once you know where he is, there's no, re no reason to fight him. Don't give him the chance. Patsy will take him down right over the smoke. And yet he's forced to reveal himself. That's got to be annoying. He must have felt like there was a real opportunity and more grenades. That's about, what, three, four different grenades thrown his way. And finally, they get rid of him. Eagle shot in return. Stair shows up. Wonderful. But the Galil going to be able to take 
a couple of people down from that A defense. Yeah, huge kills to get, but you could see Spirit even slowing it down and just checking the flank really quick. They missed the timing. Good tag, but he doesn't go down. Two HP. Oh, but this is doable. Magic's and Siren. Yes, it is. Although Lawrence making a lot of noise. They know that he's coming this way. Hard for him to check everything. He has the right idea, but just as he turns around, the Vegas will take him down. He really had a hard time on Nuke as well, Slacks. Yes, we're talking about it just a little bit. Oh, and they try to see if they can regain some control, which is actually pretty smart for the CT side. I like to see that, but unfortunately, they also get slaughtered trying to get in there. Two versus two now. And look at this position in the middle. Chopper. He might just sneak in and get a free kill. He is inches away from doing that. Almost catching the shadow. Lanx, I don't think he realizes how much danger he's in. But he's going to get the kill on, on Magic. Because that's at least something now. Yeah, there's the free kill. If that would have reversed the order, that's almost a, a win immediately for the side as a spirit. For sure. Chopper's even ignoring the M4. Stairs. Rotating over. Shifting through the flank. Is Chopper going to be able to read this? <laughs> It's close again. Oh, but Stair was looking the other way. It's only refresh with an MP9. AK-47 has been recovered, but it's on the other side of the map. It cannot be involved. Bullets over. Flank is coming in, but with just a USP, kind of hard to do anything with. Oh, so maybe a chance. He sees one of them back there. The bomb is planted, but only just freshly Sirens on his own, and he's going to get wiped out. Siphon with the triple, Lanx with the double. Again, this weird seesaw going back and forth is not going to be working out for them. Eventually, they will have to put together a string of rounds. Oh, Magic's not ready for that at all. Yeah, just look at this. Almost, almost a three-man lean to the short side. That's actually kind of interesting. I wonder if they're going to be ready for it, Spirit. You might catch one and then just never realize that there's going to be two more people. But when they get the early kill and the follow-up, wonderful. Let's crack this one open. And yeah, he wasn't expecting a third play, but because of the double, they still should be winning this round. Yeah. Siphon's back here. They have time to run to the B-bomb side. With the but I don't think Siren has any reason to overexpose himself. He doesn't need to challenge anything. He is, and he goes down. Now, Siphon can attempt the 1v1. This is very, very risky. Chopper right down below. He should get this kill, and he will. But that is, you're right, he had no reason to overexpose him coming up on yeah. top of the boxes there. Then it's absolutely not worth it, but wonderful. This is uh, some good shooting on the AWP, as we expect. Six to two in their favor, and again, the money is looking dreadful for Sprout. AWP and M4. Ooh. Oh, well, he wanted to wheel it in, try and get the kill early on, but wonderful. This is what we've come to know about him. So lightning fast with the flicks. Ivan's gonna come in. He took his time to line up the shot. It's gonna be Longs instead to take down Magics and stare on that AWP. He has to hit this shot right away. Turn it into a 2 on 2 Back up his there, and actually, that's very aggressive. Look at Longs. He's just out fighting in front of the smoke. Gets taken down by Wonderful. Second kill of the round for him. And they know everything. Molotov to put some pressure on. <laughs> they take him down. I don't know if they could have seen him there. Either way, Chopper is gonna find him. Might have been just a foot. It's a risk worth taking in that scenario. This time, Team Spirit handle the uh, the partial buy around the saved weapons. Good adjustment from Wonderful. He flicked upwards to open. Nice nade. Siren already chewed up from the start. But oh, Batsy, double opening on the Mac 10. That's too much. Chopper's given him the Mac 10 powers. It must be. He's, he's blessed it. He's given him the old Vega Squadron strengths. and return too early to celebrate anything with Sprout here. They need every single round they could get for the rest of this one. Siphon in the middle, and that's a long range to be fighting with an SMG, so at least it's back into a three on three. And Wonderful does not have the AWP. Gonna be sneaking up here with the AK. Smoke down in front, Molotov a little bit further behind, and you can see Stairs very, very nervous that someone's gonna be flashing around that corner. Chopper, a little bit closer up than Stair was ready for, and Siphon, he's at the corner. Nasty angle. I don't think Chopper can see anything there, but he almost dies trying to escape. They're one versus two, and wonderful panic spraying through. Longs will take him down. Pretty boy, a fair bit of time. Stare that smoke. Surely someone's going to be watching that. So suspicious, and they're going to be able to take him down. Patsy with the kill. Slacks flashed out. They know it as well, and that SMG just can't survive that fight. Unfortunate. I think he spotted Chopper jumping up. 
and wanted to try and get him as he was coming through the smoke, but man, Spirit is just deleting him. And this time, this tank, no utility. No smoke wall set up. There wasn't a whole lot of nades left for Team Spirit. And this is just so clean. Yeah. They have a lot of different looks that they can go to. Even if even if they're being countered a little bit, they change it up. They go a little bit slower this time. Like you pointed out, they don't just straight up take the ramp. So that's a clean round. Nice shot from Siren. That's filthy. I want that Team 3D. Oh, no. If you jump up and go for this fight, Locks, you might be in for a world of hurt. Yeah, you don't expect it. Good kill. That's the B defender. And it's again middle. Yeah, and they have to know there's at least... They, they saw at least two defenders. They might even realize the third is there. And their level of confidence in this particular map. Slacks. Yeah, I don't know how you would have checked that. Nancy's going to get the kill. Siren on the follow-up. It is looking so good right now for Spirit in this map. Siphon's on his own in a one versus four, and it's just too far gone. The bomb is down. He doesn't have any other tools that he would need to win this round. So Spirit, they have put together a remarkable first half at this point in time. 10 to 5 is going to be the scoreline. They are well on the way. I think, ooh, Spirit might get pulled into this. This is yeah. going to be a firefight. They're waiting down there. Opening kill. Stamp. That's actually really important. He gets that first one. They keep swinging with the USB. Siren take it over. <laughs> and it's just a parade of headshots down on that ramp. Three SMGs on the board for Team Spirit. So, a bit of a bonus round. A bit of weaker weapons to fight with. Good turn for Magix. Good turn around to find the kill on the Lonks. And everyone else from Sprout is slowed. A defensive smoke set up. And how do you do this if you're Sprout? It's going to be very tricky. Those smokes really do make it hard to find anyone, which means you can't really clear the bomb site. And this is some G's. They get to fight so close again because of the smokes. More grenades keep raining in. A nice shot onto Stair as well. Pansy will get that one. Refresh very, very low on health. And they're boxed in at the moment. They can bail out. Patsy oh. has to be aggressive. He has to be aggressive. It might not be over yet, but at least they've got a shot at it here. One versus two. And they can guess where Patsy's coming from. Double setup as he turns the corner. Siphon's there with the AK in hand. He's going to be going down. Refresh is low. Oh, no. He gets dropped as well. One versus two. Yeah, they they made the right call. They even knew he was coming back to get them. This yeah. is such good work for Magix as well. He's causing so many issues. Two kills, defensive smoke that creates a new angle. What a cleanup from Patsy. They bust up the stack. A little bit of chip damage on a stair down to 62. Here comes the turn of the corner. Shot from the off. Flashbang to follow it up. Oh, what a great double kill. No smokes, no utility to give any kind of a warning. That's a devastating flashbang that Refresh gets to throw around the corner. That absolutely opened up everything. Chopper wants to be there, but this is a risky one. Three versus four in the retake. Chopper sneaking in. He's going to get one of them, but they don't know about Refresh. They're not really even looking there right now. His position is so powerful. They don't have a Molotov to get rid of him either. They have some smokes, so maybe they could try and double smoke it and, and just hope to get a defuse in there. That's probably the only thing you do right now. I don't think you're fighting your way out of this round if you're on the spirit side. Yeah, there we go, crouching in. They're going to get one, but refresh. He reads it. Good stuff coming through here. Patsy's going to be here with the AWP, but you have to imagine this is all going to be blocked off. There's three smokes, plenty of Molotovs and flashbangs to use, and obviously stare with this kind of position. Oh, great, great tap. The AWP again hits the deck, and this time it's not recoverable. And it'll be an eighth round for Sprout as they close the gap to six, or five. I can do math. You got there eventually. I can add. So within the margin, Vera. One of the, so somewhere in there. Oh. It's there. Got the right idea, but Wonderful's gonna catch him. He knew someone was behind the curtain. He wanted to be clever about it. I can't even blame him. If he can sneak around that corner, he has a great opening into the bomb side, but unfortunately, Wonderful was there lurking on the other side. Double opening in favor of Spirit. It's a huge problem. They're, they're going to have to call Siphon's number again, say, could you maybe get another th three or four kills in this round? It'd <laughs> be really great if you could. Hey, I know you've been working hard, but maybe just a little bit extra. Maybe yeah. pick up that extra shift. There goes Patsy. That's refreshed out on top. He's down to 36 HP. Chopper's here, Wonderful's here, and Siren is rotating over. And Siren's got a plethora of nades to use. Magix is pushing, or checking B. Not pushing quite yet. Yeah, what a setup they have. Spirit, they're really confident this is going to be the play that's coming, and they're not wrong either. Gotta be careful you don't walk into that AWP out there. Molotov? That puts so much pressure on them, but they're going to boost on top to try and look for it. If they find anyone here, this round might just be over. It's so close. Siphon, that's something he can't fight. What a boost, especially with the Molotov next to them. 
I can absolutely see why Sprout don't see that coming. 30 seconds left now. Slacks and Refresh, they need a miracle in this round. This is I, almost unwinnable already. Siren getting the kill and the follow-up. It's finding a winning recipe. They got three rounds straight off the virtue of resetting the economy. And busting it wide open. But now you got to go back against guns. And now AKs have been picked up. Now an AWP has been salvaged as well. And now they're going to try and go for it. Up the A ramp. And backup is being called for Patsy now. Flashed in to try and take them down. And he wins the fight against there. He's still here. This is crazy. Siphon spinning around. And he does catch the kill. 22 seconds. And Slacks getting a double. He keeps going. Triple in the round before he's finally up. But they're not done yet. Still a 2-1-2. Two -two. There is a flank coming in, but the problem no is time. if this bomb dies, there we go. Siphon's out of it, and I don't think that long I don't think he can get it. Even if he wins the fight, he does not have the time for it. Magic's good couple of kills at the end, and it's 15 to 8. One of those kill slacks. Nice shot from Magic's. Defense holds strong. It adjusts, and it arrives at the perfect moment. Partially thanks to Patsy's aggressive play, it's Siphon's found his 30th kill. And, they, Again. and he was rewarded with a deagle. Yeah, rod-like performance from him, but they need more than just the one player. Chopper and Wonderful coming back into the round. It's still a three on three. Everything in the line. Sprout one round away from getting knocked out. Three kills away from getting knocked out at the moment. And they might grow as a group to try and find out what's going on. This little peak for information is huge. Schlax nearly giving up his life. Maggie's coming in, and now it's just Siphon left. One versus one against Wonderful, who's got all the health in the world, even with low health. His first bullet accuracy in this map has been off the charts. I'm sure he feels confident in this. Wonderful walking around the corner, sees him. He's got to be careful now. His position revealed, swings out for it. He's going to be going down. Oh, God. He did everything that he could, but it will be the end of the road for Sprout. Spirit will live on as they win in a 2-0 fashion. 16-8.